40 OS 7.2 is out and there are dozens of new features. Let's look at some of the best. All right, so we have 7.2. There are dozens and dozens of new features in just about any area, VPN, operational technology, um, uh, SD-WAN, HA, and so on. But let's take a look at some of the, probably the more used features. So uh, the very first thing that I will do is to head over to system, feature visibility, uh, enable workflow management. Once you do so, you will see that in your firewall policy, there's a new feature which allows you to set policy expiration. By default, it is 30 days, but you can specify the date and the hour. Another thing is um, the uh, changes summary. That is, every time you change your policy, you can actually set uh, a description of the change so you can audit. So. Let's just uh, create. Um, let's just create a simple policy: incoming port three, outgoing port one. Let's just set this one. All right. Let's make it flow based. Let's enable antivirus, and let's uh, apply that. Now here you can set. Uh, the changes, the change summary. So let's uh, initial policy. And of course, every time you actually change that policy, you will add up uh, more information. So you can actually audit your policy uh, as time goes on. All right. All right, now another change, which is probably one of my favorites since I'm actually a big fan of the debug functions of the 48 is in network diagnostics where you can finally uh, see your packet capture and your debug flow in the graphical user interface. So just choose the interface you want to capture uh, use the different filters you're all probably quite familiar with that and start capture and you can see the capture here in the um, graphical user interface you don't need to see it in the command line you don't need to save it as a pcap you can do so but you don't need to and you can actually play around with different filters and uh, have an overview of what is happening on the different uh, interfaces in your 48. Another uh, pain is the debug flow. Again, you can play around with the different uh, filters. Let's start the uh, debug flow. Uh, I love it. And here you can actually play and filter using um, different options. Another thing that you can do is by pressing the plus sign function, again, add up different filters, different values uh, straight from the graphical user interface. All right, let's move on to um, security policies, antivirus, create new you can actually set an inline 40 sandbox that is if you create your antivirus security profile in proxy mode you can actually set a 40 sandbox it needs to be a 40 sandbox appliance so let's just use the config system 40 sandbox and there it is and let's set the status to enable sorry for that all right and let's set an inline scan 
again to enable and from here you actually set uh, the address of your server your 40 sandbox appliance all right now let's just um, edit a new interface let's name it LAN 2 um, and enable the HCP server and let's set the address to 10.0.3.1 okay and let's move back again to logs and report and let's look at the system events and here again you can see that the system event is much more intuitive than before you can see general system events such as login successful configuration change and so on and here you can see the total event and their level of information either notice alert emergency and so on if you press the details pane you will see it in a table view so that was a very quick intro to 7.2 more is coming very soon